Fox 4 News is gearing up to bring you extended coverage of the total solar eclipse. Now just about a month away, it takes place April 8th. Many people will never see another one, so this is really an incredible learning opportunity for children. Fox 4's Alex Boyer joins us now with how UT Arlington is helping students, and I guess parents too, when the students <laughs> share it with mom and dad and Alex. Yeah, that's right. Really the entire family, right, Heather? You know, that total eclipse is fast approaching and lucky for us in North Texas. We are in the path of totality, which means, of course, that we're going to get some pretty incredible views. And as you mentioned, it's going to be an event for a lifetime. You know, what better place for kids to learn about that experience than at the UT Arlington Planetarium? The planetarium at UT Arlington is buzzing with activity. Students of all ages are eager to learn about the total eclipse happening next month. I feel very fortunate that it is actually happening in my town, and it is approximately like once in a 400-year opportunity. Inside the massive dome, <laughs> elementary school students from Rockwall ISD got an out-of-this-world lesson. We are experiencing a total solar eclipse on Monday, April 8th. On that day, for about 3 minutes, 20 seconds, the moon will cover the sun. A large part of North Texas is in the path of totality, including Fort Worth, Arlington, and Dallas. UTA Planetarium Program Coordinator McKenna Dowd says it will feel like dusk or dawn. At that point, you can take off your glasses and you'll be able to see just like there's almost no sun. Doubt says you won't just see the total eclipse, but you can hear it and feel it. It's going to get kind of dark. It's going to feel, you know, a little, a little weird. It might feel a little cooler. You can listen to the animals and how they're reacting to these few minutes because they, they work on the schedule of the sunset and sunrise, and so they are going to think it's nighttime. The dazzling event will last for about three hours. The partial eclipse will start about 12.20 p.m., and it will end just before 3 p.m. You'll need special glasses to safely view the eclipse. Students were each given a pair funded by a $50,000 grant from NASA. Yeah, you're going to wear those glasses and, and look at the eclipse? Yeah. yeah. It's going to be like some fun. Some 1,500 North Texas students will take field trips to the UTA Planetarium to learn about the eclipse prior to the April 8th event thanks to that grant. It's a thrill for both science geeks. It's going to be incredibly cool. And everyday Texans alike. Oh, I'm excited. I know I'll be working that day, but I'm going to take a break and go outside and see it because we're not going to see it again. What do you think about uh, the eclipse and the fact that it's going to get really dark for a few minutes? Really scary. <laughs> <laughs> And as you might imagine, the planetarium is seeing a huge uptick in folks who want to learn about the total eclipse prior to the event. Now, I mentioned that, you know, this thing will happen for about three minutes and 20 seconds, that total eclipse. That, of course, depends on where you are. They were talking about Arlington. But for instance, if you're down in the Ennis area, which is southeast of Dallas, it will be a full minute longer, four minutes and 22 seconds. Get your glasses.